now dear student we are going to discuss question number 4.14 and in this question it is given to you in a harbor wind is blowing at the speed of 72 km per hour and the flag on the mast of a boat anchored in harbor flutters along the northeast direction fine if the boat started moving at a speed of 51 km per hour to the north direction what is direction of a flag on mast of a boat clear so actually language is given to you some typical language but let us try to analyze a given situation and my dear student this is very easy question clear listen carefully and let's suppose i am assuming here just a minute yes so let's suppose i am assuming here we can say let's suppose this is north direction this is east direction and initially it is given uh, it is given to you wind is blowing at the speed of 72 km per hr clear and it is also given initially let's suppose we are assuming boat is to be at rest we can see it is actually uh, its flag is actually having uh, flag is having in northeast direction clear it means what is given to you this is we can say velocity of a wind clear with respect to boat but at the time boat is at rest so we can say velocity of a wind with respect to ground clear yes or no yes and this is given to you 72 km per hr you can convert into meter per second so we can multiply it with 5 by 18 so we can say this is 4 so we can say this is 20 meter per second clear to you so we can say this is 20 meter per second now it is given to you now boat start moving with the speed of 51 km per hr in north direction so let's suppose boat is moving in this direction it is given in a question so vb this is equal to 51 we can multiply it with 5 by 18 and we can say this is equal to 3 yes or no so we can say this is 15 meter per second now this trend when it is given initially it is in the northeast direction this angle is what 45 degree clear and it is given to you velocity of boat with respect to ground clear now let's suppose if i say to you uh, right here velocity of a, a flag velocity of a flag or you can say uh, yes we can write here velocity of flag no problem clear so we can say velocity of flag with respect to boat we have to find how can we write we can write like this velocity of a flag with respect to ground minus velocity of a boat with respect to ground clear velocity of flag with respect to ground clear it is given to you this is 20 meter per second but you have to take here two components but important part is here we are actually writing here minus sign of velocity of boat with respect to ground so it means the velocity vector of this boat changes clear whenever we are discussing about velocity of flag with respect to moving boat clear it means what i can do here i can actually draw velocity vector of a boat like this this is velocity of boat clear yes or no yes now we can say uh, this angle is already 45 we know this angle is 90 so total angle between these two vector is 135 degree clear to everyone this angle we have 135 degree this one 135 degree clear now let's suppose i am assuming the resultant vector is given by this one just assuming i don't know what is the exact location but we can assume this is the velocity of a flag with respect to boat and i am assuming here this is making an angle beta with this velocity of a flag with respect to ground clear so can we calculate here velocity of uh, can we calculate here this angle beta yes actually we can apply here uh, law of uh, parallelogram addition or we can say here we can utilize the concept of vector addition yes or no and we can find here direction how can we find direction direction is given by tan beta tan beta we can write like this this is vb sin of theta vb sin of theta divided by we can see this is equal to vf plus vb cos of theta clear to you now what is value of theta theta is the angle between vfg and vb clear it means we can say this angle is 135 so we can say vb sin 135 divided by we can say this is vf plus vb sin uh, i mean cos 135 
clear to you no now listen carefully if we calculate we can say sin 135 sin 135 equal to what sin 90 plus 45 it means we can say cos 45 so we can write like this value of 10 beta this is given by vb and this value we have cos of 45 divided by this value we have vf plus vb clear vb and this is cos 135 means cos 90 plus 45 it means we can say minus of sin 45 it means we can write like this this is minus vb and this one is sin of 45 clear sin of 45 clear everyone yes so now we can write like this yes so 10 beta value we can say value of vb vb we can say this is equal to 15 uh, 15 meter per second so we can say 15 into 1 by root 2 clear to everyone yes sir this is 51 kilometer per hour and this is 72 clear okay fine divided by we can say this is vf vf means this is 20 meter per second so 20 minus 15 by root 2 clear now if i take here lcm of under root 2 we can write 20 under root 2 minus 15 clear to you so we can write like this value of 10 beta value of 10 beta this is given by 15 by under root 2 this is 20 under root 2 minus 15 clear to you yes and this is also divided by root 2 root 2 and root 2 this is cancelled out now listen very carefully we can say this is 15 divided by under root 2 under root 2 equal to what 1.4 1.4 means we can say almost we have 28 yes or no 28 something let's suppose 29 29 minus 15 we have 40 so approximately i can say this is equal to uh, 14 point something something or we can say this is approximately equal to 15 clear so we can say 10 beta we are getting approximately equal to 1 clear it means value of beta we will get 45 clear yes or no but most important part here we are not getting exact value of 15 here we are getting value of 14 it means we will get value 1 point something 1 point something means angle we will get uh, more than 45 degree that's why you can see this resultant i draw here clear you can say actually resultant velocity of a flag with respect to boat we will get almost in the direction of east clear to you yes so we can say direction direction we can say uh, approximately we can say this is 45 degree clear or you can say this is 45.001 45.01 you can write like this clear so this is all about this question clear